Hello, this is a presentation made by CanadaCreditCardMachines.com. Today we're going to talk about choosing the right credit card machine for your business. What are the different types of hardware? There's dial-up, IP slash broadband, wireless, and cellular. Dial-up credit card machines they connect via the phone line or you can connect them via your fax line. They take about 15-25 seconds to do a transaction and they're one of the most least expensive units to invest in as a small business owner. The problem is with them, or the disadvantage is not really a problem, is that you can't be on the phone or be sending a fax at the same time as using one of these machines if you have it connected to the same line. You'll need a dedicated line if you don't want any interruptions. But most people today, if they don't want any interruptions, will just use a IP terminal. An IP slash broadband terminal runs through any high-speed internet connection. A big benefit is the transactions are even faster than dial-up. They're three to five seconds per transaction. Another benefit is you can use multiple units through one IP connection. So if you have multiple cash-out uh, centers or checkout stations, you can run, you know, three, four, five, ten units off one internet connection, where in the past you'd need dedicated phone lines for each one. So right there, that could save you potentially, potentially anywhere from thirty to fifty dollars per phone line. So if you have eight checkouts, that could be close to, uh, you know, five hundred dollars a month in savings. The disadvantage is they have a small gateway fee. It's usually somewhere between ten to twenty dollars a month. There's wireless machines. And a wireless debit, a debit and credit card machine works similar to a cordless phone. They're not cellular. We're going to talk about cellular in just a minute. But a wireless machine it has a base, and it's just like a cordless phone where you can use anywhere from 100 to 1,000 meters away. The uh, wireless machines can hook up through your IP or broadband or dial-up. They're great for services like restaurants where you have at-the-table services. They are, however, one of the most expensive units and they do take lots of wear and tear so you'll want to make sure you have a lifetime warranty on your wireless unit now cellular units they want they run on the cellular network you know which can be either GPRS or Wi-Fi they're great for mobile businesses uh, shipping uh, delivery delivery fast food mobile pet salons massage therapists that are mobile, contractors, plumbers, electricians, etc. They're fantastic that way. You do ever want to check into the network connection before uh, you invest in one. want to make sure that the connection is strong in your area. Just because you get good cell phone reception doesn't mean you're going to necessarily get good data plan reception. The GPRS network, a lot of times the towers are a little bit different. The disadvantage is you do have to pay an airtime expense. <clears throat> But if you're not paying for a phone line in a business, it's not really a big deal. But it can run you anywhere between $20 and $50 a month, depending on the amount of transactions you're going to be doing. They are quickly becoming one of the most popular units available out there, is the cellular uh, credit card machines. Well, that's all for the presentation. If you're looking for more information, go to www.canadacreditcardmachines.com. That's C-A-N-A-D-A-C-R-E-D-I-T. C-A-R-D-M-A-C-H-I-N-E-S dot com.